Hey guys, PSV here, and welcome to a little tutorial. And today I'm going to be showing you how to get uh, 1.6 Pro mods onto ETS2, so Euro Truck Simulator 2 after the 1.9 update. So first of all, you, I'm just going to apologise and say sorry for not uploading for a couple of weeks. I had a few problems with the computer, and then um, I was ill. And then I've also been streaming a hell of a lot. So if you haven't ch checked out me on Twitch, go over and check me out. Maybe drop a follow because I'm streaming loads on there at the moment. So here we go. Let's get into the tutorial. So first of all, you want to head over to this website. Link will be down in the description. Promods.net. You come to a page looking like this. You have got to create an account. An account is free to create. So create it. Because if you have to have an account to download basically on this website. So here we go. So we're going to go down to download. I've noticed since uh, when I click record my computer seems to go like let's be slow for me. So it might be a bit slow. Come on. Here we go. Right. So you come to a page looking like this. I do apologise about the slow internet. My internet has been a bit terrible at the moment so you come to a page looking like this and this is the one that you want pro, pro mods um, content v160 and it should say current in brackets at the time that you do this this may not be at the top of the list so what you do is click on that and you come to a page looking like this you can read through this it basically tells you the main rows that they've added some cities and stuff the countries that they've added so once you're happy with that click download this is where it will be slow. Click uh, select your language. So mine's English. So we come to a page looking like this. If you see up here, it says you are currently uh, step one or three. What we do? This is the important bit. This file here, you need to have. Okay. So you want to click that, click that, and then it has it there. If you're using Google Chrome, this does open in a separate window. So you just shut that window down. Right, go to step two. Right, you can pay 60p or one dollar to download the, all the mods in one file. Otherwise, you can just download them individually. I've only downloaded one and three, and that seemed to work for me. Okay, so what you can do is just click them, click them, and they'll open up, uh, download, and open up in WinRAR. So this is what it looks like. So here we go, so here we've got part 1 and part 3. The only reason I didn't get part 2 is because I've noticed that they've got the both same content on there. So it has a readme text file on part 1. And the ones that I have put, and it works for me, in my game I've put this one, this one, and this one into my Euro Truck Mods folder. So if you don't know how to get your Euro Truck mod folder, I will show you now. So what you can do, you want to click Start, Documents, Euro Truck Simulator 2, Mods. As you can see here, I've got a hell of a lot of mods in here. And these ones here, these ones here that I've highlighted are my Pro Mods. Okay? So what you can do is just drag that one into there, that one into there and this one into there and then make sure your euro truck's not open the game's not open make sure the game's shut down for it to work because i noticed it's safer putting mods in when your game's not open then it should just shut all this down then open up your game and then yeah that's your game sorted if you have got any problems please leave comments down um below and i'll try my best to help you but that is how i've done it and yeah, I hope this video has helped you guys. So please ensure to leave it a thumbs up. And don't forget to go and check out my Twitch page. And look out for more videos. And I'm going to be doing quite a few more of these tutorials. To help my followers and subscribers out there. So, like I said, please ensure to leave this a rating. And I hope to see you guys in my next video.